Even anglers who've seen just about everything at the Harlem Mere Waterway haven't seen a fish like this. To me, the snakehead is like Bigfoot. You know, I've heard of it. It's a legend, but I've never actually seen it myself. The northern snakehead dons the sleek head of a snake fused to the body of an everyday fish. These signs featuring the image of what's known in some circles as a frankenfish are enough to stop some in Central Park in their tracks. I never saw that kind of fish. So that's the reason I took the picture to show to my kids. Look what's, what's going on in Central Park. It has appeared in the area in the past. Jimmy has caught actually snakehead and did battle with it. You know, he was like Zeus. And despite its unusual appearance, the fish made the fine dining rounds, featured on the menu at Manhattan's Gramercy Tavern restaurant late last year. But conservationists warn that it's not welcome in Central Park and are using these signs to tell anglers that catch the predatory fish to hand them over. It's a top predator, so it eats other fish and a lot of other things. And um, it also produces a lot of eggs, so it has the potential to produce a lot of young. None of the northern snakeheads turned up in surveys conducted here back in 2009 and 2011. The department is hoping for the same result during a survey set to be conducted here tomorrow. So hopefully we won't find any this year either. Snakeheads have been spotted in Flushing Meadows as well, making for quite the fish tale amongst anglers and animal lovers alike. A dog. You can't train a fish. Tracy Strahan, News 4, New York.